this video I'm going to work out a single individual integral. It's going to be the integral of x squared over e raised to the x to the third dx. All right, it's going to be a straightforward uh, integral that you would probably find in a Calc 1 class. Um, about the only uh, tweak in it is that we are going to use two different substitutions throughout the problem to get all the way to the end. All right, so initially here we're going to um, let our u be x to the third just to start a regular u substitution type problem. Okay, so we're going to let u equal x to the third. When I take the derivative of each side, I'll have du is equal to 3 x squared dx, and then going ahead and solving all the way down for that dx, I'll have a du over a 3x squared is equal to that dx. All right, so that's going to be our initial u substitution right there. So I'm going to come up here, and I'm going to start substituting things I know. The x squared is going to stay put. All right, then this x to the third right there will be my u, so e to the u. And then I'm going to replace that dx with what it equals, du over 3x to the third. All right, what that's going to allow me to do then is to go ahead and cross off those um, x squared, and it's going to let me pull the one-third out in front. So then I'm going to have a one-third, the integral of 1 over e to the u du. All right, we're going to want to move this denominator up and use our laws of exponents. So we will have a one-third, well, it helps if I write one-third, integral of an e to the negative u du. All right, now, at right here, I uh, cannot integrate e to the negative u, so I'm going to need to do another uh, u substitution, but I already used u, so I'm going to pick another letter. I'm going to pick v, because we just need to pick something else here. So v is going to equal negative u right there. I'm going to take the derivative of both sides. I'll have a dv is equal to negative du. And going ahead and solving all the way down there for that du, negative dv is equal to du. Okay, so then I'm going to come back up here, and I'm going to make some more substitutions. So I'll have the one-third out in front. The integral will have e to the v, and then substituting my du for a negative dv. What that's going to do is that's going to allow me to pull out the negative out in front. So I'll have a negative one-third integral of e to the v dv. Okay, now I am finally to some place where I can actually um, integrate this. That's just going to be a straight e to the v. All right, so one negative one third e to the v. All right, plus c. All right, I can substitute my v back in as a negative u. So negative one third e to the negative u and then the plus c. All right, this is going to let me, I'm going to do this all in one step here. This e to the negative u, I'm going to bring to the bottom and make positive, and at the same time, substitute in the x to the third for the u. So I'm going to end up with a final answer of negative 1 over a 3e to the x to the third plus c. All right, so pretty much a straightforward um, integral you would see, find in a Calc 1 class, but just using two different letters and doing two different substitutions there to actually integrate and get all the way down to your final answer. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends so they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.